All right, what's up, y'all? This is like the third time I tried to record this. I hope this doesn't come off too aggressive or too like, like complainy because really it's not that deep, and I'm not trying to be complainy. But I am going to be talking about something that I have a bit of a gripe with, and like um, something I'm not upset about, but something I've I'm thinking about changing. So basically, I, I I'm going to be more careful about what commissions I take, and the reason why is because. Um, I had somebody ask me to draw them recently, um, and it didn't go how I would have liked it to go, and that's partially because of that person, but I think mostly because of me, so I'm gonna get into it. So I don't want to disclose who they are, their whole information, that's beside the point, but they basically came up to me, they were like, oh, can you draw me? I'm asking, I'm acting like they like physically came up to me, but anyway, at this point, um, and they're asking me, can you make me look cute? And I'm like, of course, yeah, I can draw a cute little character. And they're like, can you draw me without outlining me? And I'm like, yeah, of course. I, that's what all my commissions have always been. Actually, there might be one that I did where I outlined somebody. I don't like doing that, but I think I did it once before. And so I'm working on this animated version of this girl and um I'm getting through it and you know I bro I'm not a great artist okay let's be honest I will sketch I also got like <laughs> like I, I don't know I'm ROCD too so like I will sit there and draw a character for an hour like an hour or two maybe three just the sketch trying to figure out what I want like just tweaking the sketch right so I'm tweaking this sketch and I'm like, it doesn't really, it looks enough like her is what I was saying. It looks enough like her to be a character. So after taking all that time, just making this sketch look mildly like her, I kind of like went kind of loose on the rest of it. Like it wasn't bad. I actually posted and everybody was like, oh, this is really great. And I, but personally, I didn't feel like it was the greatest thing ever. So I send it to her and she's like, ah, I love it. It's really cute, but it doesn't really look like me. And I'm like, bro, I completely understand. She was like, just tweak the eyes, make them more this or that. And I was like, all right, so I'm going in, I'm tweaking things. This is like my least favorite thing to do <laughs> is go into a finished product and like edit it. But it was like, all right, well, I did this commission. I'm obligated, blah, blah, blah. Let me just fix it. And I send her the fixed quote unquote product. And she's like, yeah, I like it again. It's cute. It doesn't look like me though. And I was like, dude, like I understand. And then I, I felt like, okay, so this one, I kind of half, like it's half baked. Let's be honest. This is something I could have drawn back in 20, 20 freaking 16 or something. So let me actually focus on it. And it wasn't even because of her, it was more like a determination thing. So I went in, I started off from scratch. I told her, give me like a day or two, I can finish it. Started off from scratch. I came out with a product that I really liked, but it didn't really look like her. So I messaged her and I say, this is, I love this. I like it a lot, but it doesn't look like you. I will give you your money back if you don't want it. So don't even worry about it. And she sees it and she's like, oh wow, like it really is nice, but it doesn't look like me. And at this point, it's like, yeah, I didn't think you would want it. And I'm mildly frustrated, but it's like, actually, I wasn't frustrated at all because I really like the finished product. So giving her her money back is like exchange for a piece that I feel really good about. And I think I'm gonna post that today. But anyway, that's beside the point. And, uh, I don't know, I just thinking about it, that whole situation sucked. Like, it wasn't ideal, like, at all. So, first off, she's gonna be like, oh, like, I really love your work, I really like your art, but, like, I need my money back, because I don't, the product doesn't look enough like me. And I'm like, so where do you draw the line between something that looks like you and something that fits the style of an artist? She doesn't even follow me. She doesn't know, like she probably clips through like a few of my drawings, like drawing a person and drawing from like your idea of what somebody that fits a style looks like is different. So there's like a give and take. But the biggest problem is I'm not trained in anatomy. Like I'm not trained, I'm not even trained in art. 
I'm barely an artist, to be honest. Like, I just see things. I don't even have an eye for art. <laughs> like, I don't even have an eye for art, bro. Like, so, like, it's not her fault that I'm not at the level where I can really draw her the way that she wants to be drawn. And, you know, that kind of sucks. But, like... I don't think I'm going to take on a project like this unless I know that I can really do that person justice. Like, I need to study anatomy. I need to study lighting. I need to study, like, facial features before I can really, really get into this type of stuff. And, you know, there's other commissions down the line that there's ones I need to work on literally today where... They want me to draw a girl with another girl in the sunset and like all this other stuff. That's fine because that's, they know my style. They know what they're going to get. But when it's somebody who first off doesn't follow me, doesn't know my progression of my art, what kind of product they could get. And they want it to look like them while also not outlining it and also being not like you don't even know the style you're gonna get that's not fair to me or you I don't, where am i going with this i don't know i guess i'm just saying like i'm thinking before i start just jumping into doing these face commissions <laughs> face commissions these commissions where i'm just drawing people's faces and i don't know if i can really do them justice you know is that fair does that make sense like even if i i, I can already imagine the argument where it's like you if you keep practicing drawing people's faces you'll just get better and better at it and like maybe but really i should just be studying like i said anatomy and facial like muscles and features and like without having people having to pay people back for not doing a great job so you know i came into this thinking it was her fault but it's obviously my fault <laughs> Like, it's obviously Jared. Like, what, bro? Bro, I don't know. Well, it was a little bit of hers, too. She, she should have known, like, what my style looked like. But, yeah. Oh, that kind of sucks for her. And really, it all worked out for me because I got a product that I really like. But, yeah. Also, I'm not complaining. Like, I love doing what I do. You know? I love the product. <laughs> it's just... I'm gonna think about it before I do this type of stuff. So there's album covers I need to do in the near future. And I'm just gonna make sure that the people know my style and they have a general idea of what they're gonna get. That's fair, right? Can somebody, can somebody talk to me? Like, <laughs> like can somebody talk, like, am I wrong? Am I wrong? Like, in everything I'm saying here, I'm not freaking like, opposed to anything like let me know this video is going on for way too long this is longer than the instagram appreciation video i'm just ranting at this point but yeah thank you for watching wow you know <laughs> if you got this far congrats <laughs> like i don't know it's hot in here bro um if you want something to look exactly like you take a picture and like get an editor to edit it so it looks like you're flying around with unicorns if you want somebody with a particular style to draw you and make it look exactly like you and you don't want them to outline it <laughs> bro make sure that they have the style that's going to compliment your face which is hard to decide i get yeah okay I don't know, maybe I'm crazy. Anyway, this is going on for way too long. It's 10 minutes of Jared ranting. I'm sorry, nobody wants to hear this crap. All right, I'm out, I'm out. Thank y'all, Papa Bless, night-night. Love you, bye.